Hey friends, I have some exciting news. First of all, if you saw my last video, my flu is over and I have gone seven days, one entire week without any coffee. No decaf, no every once in a while, no slipsies. I am coffee free. This is the longest I've ever gone without coffee in my adult life and I am not exaggerating. And man, oh man, was it worth it. I feel insanely better. Okay, so the first few days I, I had the flu, so it made it a little easier for me. But the rest of it, like after I finally got done with the headaches and that kind of thing, I feel the only way I know how to describe it is neutered, but like in a good way, if that makes any sense. Like I definitely yearned for a cup of coffee. I think it was more out of habit than anything else. But I definitely, you know, once you get through it, I feel so calm and at peace. Like I can give all of myself to a conversation and to the people around me. And some of that's because I rested because I was sick. But a lot of it, I just don't feel that constant edge that I did when I was drinking coffee. And I'm learning that I don't need coffee to wake up. I can just wake up to wake up and it's like a whole new world. It's like a new toy almost. Anyway, if you have a serious coffee addiction like I apparently did and didn't realize it, I highly recommend you give it a rest. Um, I, If you are a moderator and you can have a cup or two of coffee a day and you don't really see any benefits or side effects of getting rid of the coffee, then this message is not for you. But if you are a full-blown, all-day caffeine head, I seriously highly recommend you give it a rest for a little while. It is worth it on the other side of that tunnel. Anyway, I am feeling funky, fresh, and fabulous, and I feel back. So look forward to some new content coming back. Thank you so much for being so supportive through my slump in posting and the kindness that you've shown me through my videos where I am a negative Nancy. I appreciate you. God bless you and I will see you back soon.